My throat hurts really badly. What the heck? Oh, it's Saturday night. A break for the wicked on the weekend. Mama, can I get another amen? Oh, oh, it's Saturday night. Hey guys, it's Izzy, and today we are going to be vlogging because I have nothing else to do. I really should be studying for finals, but this is going to be a fun adventure for all of us, so like... Join me. We're ready. <laughs> so today I'm not gonna have time to ride because I have to get back and study for finals, but I um, am gonna go see Lucky, make sure he's not dead. Yeah. And hang out with him for a little bit. It's gonna be a fun time, my dudes, and you should join me. Outfit of the day, this nice Kentucky three-day event shirt and some Nike shorts. Yeah. It's keys. Bag full of stuff. Let's go. So, hey friends. Um. So, first thing this morning, since exams are coming up, I have to go to a review session for physiology, and honestly, not looking forward to that exam. Like, 10 out of 10, gonna fail. Um, but I have to pass, so I can ride ponies this summer, because that's all I would do in my life. And, so I have to go to a review session from like 10.30 to 12, or... 30 or something like that. I didn't hit the person in the road. Congratulate me. But anyways. So after that, I'm gonna go drive and see Lucky. Like I said, no time to ride. Um yeah. Um right now though, I am heading to get Chick-fil-A because I'm gonna be real. I have an addiction and I one, need to get coffee because I'm not looking too hot this morning. And two, I really want some chicken minis. If you don't like chicken minis, we can't be friends. Okay? Okay. Like, if you're vegetarian, that's fine. But, like, if you're not vegetarian and you don't like chicken minis, we can't be friends. Goodbye. I would just like to say that it is 10 11 and I have to be meeting at 10 30 and I have yet to get to Chick-fil-A um, that's all I would just like to say, Brendan Yuri is my king. That's all. Okay, honestly, today is gonna be more of a me in the car traveling vlog, but I'm almost at Chick fil A, so no worries. Um, it's like 10 20 now. I have 10 minutes to get my food and go back to school. So, honestly, I'm pretty screwed. I'm gonna be late, but just saying, coffee and chicken, chicken minis are very important. 
so we're going inside because the drive through line, I will show it to you. It is absolutely insane, and I feel like I might have better chances inside, so let's go. Haha, ha, catch me literally probably gonna get hit by a car, but it's fine. I forgot the issue with vlogging on my phone is storage, but no worries, friends. I just deleted 2,000 photos, so I think we're good, but I got my iced coffee and I'm happy. I just parked, and honestly, I'm in distress. I don't want to be here. Okay, I'm heading in. Catch you guys on the flip side of me being dead. That was freaking painful. Honestly, I'm gonna fail this exam, but it's fine. Okay, so now I am heading to the barn for a little bit. Just finished off that review session. Okay, I'm gonna say I knew more than I thought I knew, but I mean. Also, can I just say I am so excited for summer because one, my best friend, Mira, if you don't follow her, um, her Instagram's right here, but she is the coolest person ever, and I freaking love her. She is coming to come visit me, actually, in exactly a month from today, and I am freaking out. I have not seen her in a year. We met over Instagram, um, when I'm pretty sure, like, I was starting a new, like, group chat on Instagram or something, and I, like, posted, and I was like, hey, if you want to be in my group chat like swipe up or something and she you know she like freaking swiped up and then we started talking and she is like the best person ever and she's like at least half of the like reason like I got into eventing and how I got into eventing and I freaking love her she also has this autonomia like me and we like can bond about our struggles and it makes me so happy but she is coming in a month and I am freaking out. She's staying for a week. She's flying in from DC. And we're gonna do so many fun things. I'm gonna let her ride Lucky. She's gonna um, come see 40. She's gonna, we're just gonna do all kinds of fun stuff. We'll also be visiting the Atlanta Summer Classic Horse Show week two, I think on Saturday when the Grand Prix is. So if you're going to that, like, let me know. We'll come say hi. But uh, that's one of the reasons I'm excited. <laughs> Um, yeah, just got here and I really have to pee because I drank two coffees, not one but two. That's usually I drank a good large coffee in the morning, today I drank two large coffees. I'm struggling a little bit, not gonna lie. So I'm gonna go pee. Then, oh my god, Lucky just stepped out of his stall and he's sitting there staring at me like, why aren't you coming to see me? Get him. He's saying, Mom, why aren't you coming to see me? And the answer is, I'll be there in a minute. I gotta pee. Well, I'm gonna go get Lucky out of his stall now. I'm not gonna lie, for it's been raining for a couple of days now and it's actually Kind of shocking it's supposed to actually storm for the entire like next week I'm not looking forward to that but at least I'll be in exams and won't be having to worry about riding because I'll be too stressed to ride 
But yeah, I'm gonna go get the pony and let's go. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there with your angel face. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. You're so fat and lazy. Even your buddy came out. Come on. There you go. Good boy. Oh my god. He's following me. Look at this bond. This is bond. This is actually bond. Hashtag liberty. Hashtag natural horsemanship. Hashtag life. Hashtag no bits. Hashtag bits or abuse. Hashtag look at this. Oh my god. Such a bond. Come on. Come on. He says no. Grass is important. Just kidding. We don't have a bond. I got a pony. I got a pony. Hello. Hello there. So I've been asked a couple of times, Izzy, how do you treat scratches or rain rot? Because, um, especially around this time of year, it can be very prominent. So, um, Lucky has some on his back legs. So today, um, in this vlog, I'm going to show you a little bit about how I treat it. This is what works for me. Lucky, calm down. I'm right here. So, first. Let me get my stuff. This is all my washing stuff. It's warm enough, so I'm gonna give him, uh, he's pretty clean, so I'm just gonna bathe his hind legs where it is. But I have this, I believe it's called Malicide. I will let you know once I do it, but I'll show you how to use it. It is pretty expensive, but well, let me tell you, it is godsend. It knocks rain rot, scratches, all of that out in like one wash. So I will show you guys all about that and I will show you how to make it and fun stuff. First is we are going to take a bucket and fill it with water. Okay, so this is the stuff I use. It is almost out actually but i have just enough to wash his hind legs so that's good but we are going to put a little bit of this in there like that i may use the rest of this just to put directly on his hind legs since it's kind of strong you can see he has it kind of bad right here especially can't really see my camera so i don't know if you can see but you see scabbies and his hair is pulling off so we're gonna have to wash that really well with the shampoo. A sponge in here, let it start soaking up some of that. We're gonna start by wetting the area. He hates it. He actually hates it so much, so I apologize, but I will try to get video of this. He's calmed down now so I can film, but just make sure to really wet up the areas. He tends to get it right here and down here on his white socks and kind of just pretty much all up and down his leg in this area. So. I'm just wetting that really good, basically how you would bait a horse to begin with. Okay, so now I'm taking this and I'm just sponging it onto the area and scrubbing it a little bit to get some of the scabs off. I'm just going all up and down his leg. Also, I did not bring riding shoes, I'm using tennis shoes and they are about to get soaked, but whatever. Now we are just going to let this sit for 10 minutes. He does not get them on his front legs. I mean, I feel like a lot of horses do that. I don't know really the reason why that is, so if you know, let me know down in the comments, but we're gonna let all of this sit for 10 minutes, let it soak in, then we will wash it off. Okay, now we are rinsing it off. It's almost off. Okay, so as of right now, I just have him drying off in the barn. Yeah, actually, it feels a lot better since most of the scabs are off. And then I am going to put some cream on it and then we'll be done. I can't find the usual stuff I use on it, but I'll be using this. This works pretty well too, but it's just. So my phone pretty much is all the way out of storage, but basically what I did is I took the paste and put it all the way down the backs of his legs like that. And it should clear up within a few days. I mean, I'll come up like every single day this week to 
take care of it, but got to get rid of that stuff because we got to have our ponies in high quality good shape. No. <laughs> But anyways, that was my vlog today. I'm going to cut it off here since my phone is about to kill me for being out of storage. But thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry there wasn't very many pony, there wasn't that much pony stuff going on. But I had a busy day and I have to get back so I can study for my physiology exam. Woo! So thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time. Subscribe to my channel if you like my channel, if you like my content, if you think I'm funny, if I'm a cool person. Woo! I'm talking so fast. Good luck. I'm desperate and filming this over Snapchat because I'm out of storage officially. But thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye!